What's good YouTube? It's your boy Nuato and we here with another video and we finally made it. 2K24. Let's get it. So yeah, for the my career, you can go straight to your team. There's no college, no summer league, no draft, just straight to the league. So you know what? I'm, I'm actually cool with that. But let's get straight to the gameplay. What an intro. It looks like we only have two affiliations this year, y'all. Hey, you start your NBA career or go in the city? Of course we're going to start the NBA career. Badge level progression. It's time to give yourself an edge on the court through badge level progression system. Bronze are automatically equipped. Badge performance. Floor setters are must modify. Your badge collection will ultimately become a reflection of how you play. Now it's time to see what you made of. So it's looking like they changed up how we earning badges this year, y'all. Tell you the truth, I don't really, I don't know how I feel about it. I don't too much like it, tell you the truth. But we're going to work with it. I read a little bit on it. I see um, it can actually regress, which means it can go down if you're not making use of it. I feel like that sucks because, like, what if you're a big man and your man play outside? You're going to be losing progression for, like, pogo stick or something. You know, something, something in the paint if you got to play outside. Hopefully throughout the updates, you know, we get something to where we don't too much lose out on stuff like that. Because, hey, we work hard for these badges now. Season 1 rewards. Let's see what we got here. First off, we got three levels. Base, Pro, and Hall of Fame. They are making us pay to get better, you know, cosmetics and all that. 2K know how to get that money out of you. I feel like they already getting enough, but hey, I ain't mad at them. You know, some people be busy, can't get to a level. They'd rather buy their way through. Me, on the other hand, I might just spend a little 20, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> but yeah, that's just for some VC, you know. I want something to do, I'm playing with my main character, you know, I want to make another one. But yeah, you see we got a little golden patch. Some swim gear. Some stuff for my team, some double XP, mascots, you know, they bad. Some season emotes, some more uh, my team coach cards. They brought back the overalls, that was pretty nice. And they got pogo sticks, I'm ready to see how people gonna move around with those in the city. So that's pretty interesting. Now it's time to get into the first quest, history in the making. Hey, and not too much in the comments about why I got on 2K gear, you know, the brown shirt and the shoes. I told y'all, I'm actually grinding out here. I ain't putting no money in. Y'all gonna go through the journey with me and see the progression. Believe it. Now let's get back to the gameplay. Get ready, Pop. Get ready. What's going on? How you doing? That's crazy. Yeah, you just stay focused. Sir. Sir. There goes the MP, the most hyped prospect since LeBron James. Can this third generation NBA athlete and 19 year old superstar live up to the hype? The journey begins tonight as he plays his first NBA game. Hello, Deja Vu in here. <laughs> no, right. It's not every day you see his son playing his first NBA game. I know I shouldn't be focused on this, but 
I still can't believe that Grandpa's not here right now. It just doesn't feel right. It's okay to feel that way. I miss him too, but, you know, Grandpa would kick you behind if he knew you didn't distract you like that. <laughs> you gotta put that on the back burner, huh? Yeah, you're right. Now listen to me, there are gonna be a lot of people in your ear tonight. But you and I both know what you've been working toward all these years. Greatness. I don't care about the hype. Most of the people talking, they don't even believe what they say half the time. But me and you believe. Man, what do we believe? That I could be one of the best players to ever play this game. Yes, sir. That starts tonight. Okay, we got Shoe Rip. Let's see what she's talking about. Hey, MP, what's, hey, up? what's up? Check out these free kicks that we're hooking you up with. It look like we can go ahead and choose our shoe deal now. So that's good. We don't too much have to grind for it. I appreciate that. And we can choose whichever one we want to. You know, back then we had to grind for certain ones. But you already know I'm going. Big Nike. Just do it. Let's go. On behalf of Nike, I'd just like to wish you good luck in your first NBA game. Not that you need it, of course. We're all real excited to see what you do out there. Well, y'all seen how he hit her with that fake smile? Hey, rewind the bag and pause on his face. Talk to the assistant coach, Warren. Hey, MP! Whoa, what's she yelling for him right here? Getting me ready for this since I was six years old, so I'm ready. Hey, so that's why they say what they say about you, huh? Can't miss a legend at 19. The next GOAT. <laughs> yep, keep going. <laughs> Look, just don't try to prove it all at once, right? Look, you got the all-NBA upside, clearly. So you only need to show flashes right now. Coach, I'm trying to show my full potential. That's the competitor's mentality, and I get that. But just remember that it's a long process, MP. As long as you tap into what makes you great, we're all good. No one is expecting a fully formed MVP on day one. Loud and clear, coach. Great. So go out there and have a little fun. Hey, you know I will. Put your generational talent into full display by shifting into GOAT mode. Activate in-game goals to temporarily activate significant attributes. Okay. The more you activate go mode, the more powerful skills you unlock. New bonuses become available. As you advance. Blow past your attributes and physical limits to the highest. Break of the book, cool, cool. So basically, it's giving me two skill slots that can be activated once I meet the requirements in game. So once I meet those requirements, my attributes for those certain things will boost up. So hey, that's pretty cool. On top of you know what your badges can do for you, that's a win. All right, before we get this game started, let's walk around some. Let's see what they changed up. Go get him, Tiger. You mind if I call you Tiger? Yeah. Hmm? Kind of weird, I guess. Say so he talking to me? Got the press conference room. Cool little setup. What else we got? What else? The event level, arena tunnel. I gotta go back the other way. Check out this workout room. Prince conference room again. And that's the locker room. Practice facility. I can go to that after the game. Workout room. And look in the mirror, you can see a reflection good. Okay, okay. Careers. I know this is one of the most hey, I'm also level 60, y'all, so bear with me. Well, I'm not going to be the best ahead, right now. But, game one of the but I will be. I'm telling you. Hey, we'll take it. 
Okay, well, we can beat. I can't tell you how huge it is for a team's confidence to get a win on a oh, yeah. night. It's definitely one everyone is like I say, I got nothing to upgrade right now. I just went straight in the game. The sun's coming moving. But yeah, y'all gonna watch me go from zero to the team's hero. I'm telling you. Believe it. So yeah, I'm trying to get the ball. Yeah, give it to me. Don't worry. More, uh, uh watch out, cookies. In the books. Now one for two. Wow, you talk about Let's go. From a rookie, this one's scared of right here. Big dirty. Yeah, tighten up. Let's go. Keep it pushing. Keep it pushing. Keep it pushing. That's the goat right there. Okay. Take it. Come on, take it. Hmm? What's this? Oh, that's the skill slide. Okay. I had one for set four of this game. Okay. Come on, man. Let's go. Big fundamental. The good shot. Okay. Come on, tighten up, tighten up. Tighten up, what y'all doing? Oh, he don't miss. He do not miss. It's his turn now. Screen, take it. Roll in, hit me. Dying. Let's go. That's one. Come on, Aiden is mine. Get my stats up. Oh, he little. Work. Come on, man. That should be an easy basket. Of course he made it. He makes everything. I'm talking about splash. Hmm? Whoa, pause. Aiden against Sharich. Aiden passes to Gordon. Oh, I got you, Gordon. Set his pig for you. Six on the shot clock. Come on. Ah. Shot from the Good top shot. of the key. Oh, don't worry, I got it. Another shot. Huh, it's too little. It's good on the lay in. DJ Watch me. pulls it in. DJ's got five rebounds tonight. Pass to a Kogi. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me send my feet. Huh, let me roll in, roll in, get me. Give me, give me. Little man. Something to watch. Oh. Go push it, push it, push it. Keep Curry going. Against Gordon. And it's good. Good shot. Two points. Come on now. Thompson against Durant. Oh no. Y'all watch Curry. What? Jackson with three. Yes. Bro, he don't miss. Curry's got 25 points. Nice D. Come on, he just need a little bit of room. He made it. Not exactly consistent offense. Good pass. Look at Draymond's NBA career. Such as he's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Got me cold now. Bro, get him. What more can we do? What more can I do? Philly moving well, ball snapping and the shooting looks Mom, great rhythm. Rolling in now. Uh, here's Booker. What is the baby on? Uh-uh. Here's DJ. Uh, come here. Yeah. Bring the perfect spot to set up the layup. Let's go. DJ's gotten four this quarter. And through the years, a big help to Kevin Durant there on the defense. Keep the tempo up. Keep the tempo up. Come on, take it. I'm in there. I'm in there. Hit me, hit me. Curry. Here's DJ. Open the window. Slams it in one -handed. Pass I'm going to make it count. Mm-mm. Hold up. Hit me, hit me. Down hit me. Low. I got a baby. Come on. Both of them baby. Give me it. Oh. In for the dunk. Just a big play at this juncture of the game. Yeah, we moving, we moving. Screen, I'm in there. Hold up. The get in place. DJ. Good pass. Hang nice on there. Another screen. Oh, them two open. Yeah. Oh, Let's 
go. Misses from short yeah. range. And so Golden State. Yeah, y'all see um how to score here. One oh six and seventy one. I'm not ashamed of it. Hey, it's my first game. My person is trash right now. No cap. And remember, I'm a 60 overall, so what more can I do? But I know the potential of this build and just know it's gonna be up. Press conference. Yeah, thank y'all, thank y'all. Uh, wow, uh, listen. Uh, uh, I do my best to get to everybody, but we're gonna try to do this in an orderly fashion, all right? Uh, why don't we start uh, right over here? Gary Carson, local news. MP, you began your career with the most hype out of any NBA prospect since LeBron James. After playing a very respectable first game that saw you put a box score numbers comparable to Michael Jordan in his debut, have you made a statement here that the hype is real? Nah, I'm just trying to play my game. Uh, stay within myself and, uh, you know, feel things out. It's cool that I beat MJ's stats or whatever, but I'm not focused on that. Uh, and it's definitely not a statement. The only way for me to prove that the hype is real is to have a career like LeBron's, and that's going to take me, what, 20-something years? So, thanks, man. Good question. Uh, okay, who's next? Hey, here, here, here. Right up front. Ina Becker hier, Sportbild monatlich. Bist du sehr enttäuscht, dass du dein erstes NBA-Spiel verloren hast? Du weißt, du hast Fans auf der ganzen Welt, die dich anfeuern. Lena Becker, Sport Monthly. Are you disappointed in losing your first NBA game, knowing that you have fans watching all around the world? <laughs> um, I mean, it's always disappointing to lose. But it's just one game. And um, as far as fans watching from around the world goes, hey, I've been playing in front of global audiences for a few years now, so that's nothing new. Shouts out to Germany, though, Danke. And uh, winning is always the goal, no matter who I'm playing in front of. And losing, like I said, is always disappointing. Thank you. Uh, all right, who's next? In the back, in the back. Damian Patterson, City Free Press. What does it mean to you to be a third generation NBA player, following in the footsteps of your father Prince and grandfather Chuck? Yeah, it means I have a target on my back. I had every advantage growing up, I know that. And I've got all the natural ability in the world, thanks to my genetics. When you got both those things, people want to take you down a peg. But I thrive on that. It makes me better. Thank you. Next question. Um, right, right up front. Parfait, merci. Beatrice Corbet, La Compétition. Votre maillot est le maillot le plus vendu en France en ce moment. Avez-vous un message pour vos fans français? Beatrice Corbet, the competition. Your jersey is the number one selling jersey in France at the moment. Do you have any message for your French fans? Uh, oui, oui, actually. J'aime la France. Oh, très bien, vous parlez français. <laughs> what did she say? And she asked if you speak French. Oh, <laughs> well, there's your answer. Listen, they told me a few days ago who'd be here, so I practiced some stuff in different languages, but unfortunately, no, I don't speak French, as you guessed it. But maybe one day, though, it's a beautiful country, beautiful people, beautiful language, and, uh, hey, merci. <laughs> Thank y'all. Thank y'all. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'll see you next time. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Proud of you, MP. What? You got locked down out there. What up, Tom? Oh man, one game doesn't define you. Even if you did, blow it. So now I gotta sit and watch tape with you just to show you all the stuff I did do right? Come on, Papa thought you knew ball. You see, I knew you weren't that upset. <sighs> Look, you're right. It's just one game. It's just one game. Lucky you got me here to give you some perspective. Hey, I appreciate it, Pop. You here to keep me on track? Uh huh you know what the goal is. Greatness. That's right. Oh, uh, speaking of, 
You know who this guy is. Yeah, what about him? Just updated his all-time GOAT list. Says that you have a chance to make it to the top someday. For real? Mm -hmm. Take a look. So with all this talk about MP being the best prospect since LeBron James and Victor Webinyama being a generational talent, it got me thinking about my all-time GOAT list. Now, if you are new to the pod, you might not know that I have a passion for ranking the legends. I've spent a massive amount of time researching their careers, and I've placed them into five tiers of greatness. You can find that list on my website, by the way. Now, I love working on my GOAT list, but these guys are so legendary that they tend to stay in the same spot year after year. So I decided to add a new tier called the Got Next tier. This tier contains some of the younger guys in the league who aren't quite GOATs yet, but who, if they continue on their current trajectories, will almost certainly be in that discussion when their careers are over. Now, you may be wondering who's in the Got Next tier, so let's get to it. These are in order, by the way. Luka, Embiid, Tatum, Zion, Webinyama, and of course, MP. Now, a lot of you might be like, you know, I put MP behind Webinyama, but they're basically tied, you know, as I see it. And if MP distinguishes himself early on, I'll be happy to swap him with Vic. So, let me know. What do you think? Is there anyone who should be on the Got Next tier, but isn't? Is there anyone who is there but shouldn't be? Hit me up on social. We'll talk about it. These are the kind of people you want on your side if they're going to call you the ghost someday. Oh, come on, Pop. Media doesn't matter. It's all about winning games. Yeah, you're wrong. You need to understand how these people see you. I wish I would have played the game when I was your age. Look, all due respect, Pop, I'm not like you. I'm not going to make the same mistakes you did. I spent the best years of my career in losing situations because winning organizations didn't see me as someone who had their head screwed on time. Because you didn't, though. Not at first, OK? But when I was with Dallas, they gave me a shot. Could have been sooner if I had played the game. <sighs> All right. Son, you're trying to do something that nobody's ever done before. And when you do it, believe me, you will do it. There's going to be no question what the goal is. Waiting to the greatest of all time discourse via Logan Bradley's tier list. See where you stack up against the goats that came before you. As well as your legend in the making contemporaries. Overall, it just looks like more milestones we can achieve as we play throughout our NBA career with our mod players. So hey, it is something different. We're going to figure it out though. Let's get into these attachments. Give me that! It on the glass oh, lately. My man is an animal. Do you know what the single game record for rebounds is? Uh, 30. 55. Wilt did it in 1960. Are you kidding me? If you're looking for a number your boy might hit, try this. 31. Kevin Love, best mark since 2000s. Okay, see, that's a number we can shoot for. 55 is just ridiculous. I mean, it shouldn't even count anyway. On what grounds? On the grounds that Wilt Chamberlain was an alien. You know what? I'll allow it. Look at that. Yeah. Finally, we agree on something. Well, yeah, what planet? Pluto? Pluto. Is that still a planet? Come on now, you gotta know your history. Just by the numbers, MP had a better game than MJ. Yo, if that's not good enough, I don't know what to tell you. He looked good. I watched that game as a fan. I was excited to see what he was doing. I'm excited for the next game. It was a good game, but it was still just one game. We'll see what happens. No, he didn't set any NBA records. But MP did enough to justify all the hype going into his first NBA game. Boy, that stat line? That's on par with NBA greats. MP got his foot on the gas. He ready to go. Hey, I'm not gonna lie, them videos look real crispy and it's, it's cool. I like that. Yeah, this the end of the video. 
Let me know what y'all think about it. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm out. Gang, gang.